Oh boy. So, this is a brand new one on me. So what I think happened was, I think a rodent got stuck in the washing machine. Either with the door open and there was maybe some food attracting it in there or whatever. It got stuck in the washing machine. Something happened where the door got shut. Maybe the cycle started or didn't cycle. It went all the way to the top of the rubber gasket because there's a little place that you can hide in there where there's no water that usually gets up in there and very little water and then eventually it chewed its way out of the washing machine by chewing through the gasket. It's the only thing I can think of that would cause this kind of damage. It's a very rare, odd thing. And once the rodent chewed a hole in the gasket, then that created a place for things to go in and get sucked down into the bottom, clog the pump up, the filter so it wouldn't pump out. This is the only thing I can think of that would happen in this case scenario. It's just I can't understand what would cause the kind of hole I'm about to show you. Okay, so we're going into the washing machine and I found this sock in the filter and a couple of coins this much. However, when I got to the top and found this hole I'm about to show you, I found candy wrappers, I found a, another whole sock that got sucked into the vacuum cleaner when I sucked out the second, went, uh, I tried to suck some more stuff out and it sucked out a whole sock that's sitting out on the ground. But um, yeah, it, it looks to me like some stuff got chewed up. This is the foam insulation from inside of the washing machine. So one way or another, I think a rodent got stuck either inside and chewed his way out that direction. I know it's hard to see. It either, either got, or it came in or something happened. I don't know. I'm still tripping out on it. So look, this is up at the top. See that hole? It's the only thing I can think of that could cause that. I've never seen anything like it. And, you know, that's at the top dead center of the washing machine, so something could stay in there and live, even with it running, if it got, if it like walked up this edge and kind of hung out up in there until it was done or something. But like I said, I don't understand what would cause that. That's kind of where we're at.